Hey guys, and welcome back to Vitamin Y. So today is Friday, and that means that we are using Supervised C Bell. So, kinda happy about one thing out of the new ban list. Rota went up to two, which of course means that it helps the consistency of you bell because you know we run our warriors like armageddon 9 dark refer therefore we're a little bit more consistent yay rota to two i i'm happy about that so uh the ban list was kind of gg you mean good luck how can you say g good game if we haven't even started dueling yet uh So the list wasn't really that impressive. It was kind of boring, but you know, what's to expect? It's it's it was it was bound to be a small list. Instead of me trying to protect predict the list, I just threw a whole bunch of cards and I was just like, any of these. If I'm right on any of these, I'm happy. And uh, some of them I were right. Some I think well, only only I was right about was gear gear gear. Everything else I was like, oh wow, that's a surprise. Didn't get that. Didn't get hit. And the thing is, a lot of cards from a. Uh, and Dragons of Legends and stuff and Prime Origins didn't get hit. It's like I predicted with the whole profit margin thing. You know, it's a small list, only about a month and a half. So and it's between uh, United States Nationals and then Worlds, and then Worlds we're pretty much gonna get together and we're all gonna have a list. You, I don't you dare drop Christia. Don't you dare drop Christia. Silivori Calcos. So okay, so he says fuck his extra deck. Okay. God damn. Okay. <laughs> like, really? Fucking 3,000 beater. Okay. Uh, shit's hitting the fan already. 3,100 beater. This nigga doesn't even need to go in his extra deck when all he has to do is just drop 3,000 beaters from the fucking sky. I take 14. Uh... I know, I know, I can do fucking math. I know it's 31. 17 minus... 31 minus 17 is 14. I bet he had to whip out the calculator and everything. Alright, well, I can clearly go off, but it'd have to be next turn. Because right now, all I'm screaming is for is just kick me in the mouth. That's the only thing I'm screaming right now. At least I don't have to really worry about him dropping another 32 beater, because, you know, he can only do that when he has nothing on the field. So we're going to go ahead and drop Tinker. Next turn, I can go ham. I could can, I can probably OTK him, but i got to survive till next turn. If I can survive till next turn, you know. If I can survive till next turn, I'll be okay. Anyway, uh... Bandless was just kind of boring. There's a lot of cards that I were expecting to get hit, and yet they didn't. Uh, so, uh, like I said, pretty much the list is in between. Uh, oh, now he's setting some back row. Great. Great. So now I have to worry about back row. Previously, no back row. Didn't have to worry about it at all. Now it's kind of like, set, set. Like, <sighs> Okay, well, we might as well try it. Let the base silent doom. I guess I wouldn't be surprised if he had, like, Bottomless or Warning or one of them cards face down right now. Or Compulse or one of them cards, because, you know, you're very likely to open up with them limited cards. I'm going to go ahead and summon Doom Shaman. I will use my normal summon for effect. Effect. Oh, wait, no, never mind, never mind. I, ugh, fuck, he's got me so distracted with fucking... No, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Never mind, never mind. Don't want to do that, I actually want to activate Supervise. Okay, Supervise, Supervise. With that, okay. There we go. He's got me so damn distracted with fucking his back row and stuff, and I'm trying to focus on commentary that I'm not paying attention to what the hell I'm trying to fucking do. Whew. <sighs> Okay, effect. Don't mean to drive you crazy, but I'm trying to do this right. So go ahead and sink egg. And we'll of course go for Beals. Because Beals is the beast. And we'll go uh, Supervise Chain Tinker. Because Tinker has to go first since it's mandatory. 
Night Beam. Do I want a Night Beam? I'd rather not. I'd rather have more Revival. And then Super Vice will go ahead and bring my Doom Shaman back. Then we'll activate Super Vice again. Get his effect again. So, if you guys are wondering how on the ball I fucking am, I'm actually working on my October list, you know. It's going to be a pretty easy one, just pretty much a lot of the cards that have, were missed or did not get addressed are going to be on that particular list. So, uh, we'll go ahead and just go Supervise Chain Tinker again. See if we get a Revival card. Do we want MST right now? If I said no to Night Beam, why do I want MST, you mean? Right? I guess we'll go ahead and use my normal summon for effect, effect. Go ahead and sync it again. I really wish I can go into, uh, Tinker Effect into a Void Ogre, but I can't because I have someone mucking. Well, I could, but it wouldn't do anything, and I don't want our Greffer. Okay. Alright, Scrap Effect. Target Beals and uh, Athena. Yeah, I'm already working on it. Uh, I got to really get a true prediction. I really can't say because, of course, we're not in the format. I pretty much got to look out and see what decks really do well in Nationals, in between Nationals and uh, Worlds. For Worlds, um, they're already planning that the lists are going to be combined, and it's going to be... They're going to pull the cards down. No cards are going up. Everything's being pulled down. So... Okay, well, that's annoying. That's really annoying, actually. Ah, uh, I should have attacked, but it's fine. I should have attacked with Beals, but didn't know he's gonna have a call to haunt it. Okay. So, really gotta look, yeah, every card's going down, so, you know, here we have, for example, here we have a bitch for you at 3, over there in OCG land they have a bitch for you at 1, therefore, if you're playing Vermils in Worlds, it's at 1, you know, so, uh, you know, with everything going down, no Stratos, even though, despite, you know, us having it, so everything's being pulled down, so, uh, Ophion would be at 2, uh, Thunder King would be at 1, trying to think of, you know, switches, but majority of the time, things that are pulled down is us instead of them, so, yeah, and if it's already banned, then it's still banned, you know, so, nothing goes up, uh, so, for me to do a, you know, a prediction of the, 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 the you know, the true power of the prediction, uh, we pretty much gotta see what happens, you know, because if a lot of things don't occur, then it's really, you really can't predict and be like, oh, yeah, that's totally gonna happen, or, yeah, that's gonna, that's gonna happen, because, clearly, uh, we don't know, alright. Uh, maybe we'd have like a mirror force or something, but I'll go ahead and take the hundred. Next time I'm gonna go scrap effect on this card. Like, you should have kept the Seal Warrior Calcos. I don't know why the hell you switched it for Sanctuary, but okay, whatever. Okay. So, I'll just go scrap effect, target deals, and that is it another call of the haunted that's what i want to know and i'm gonna attack athena with deals not because if you want to honest me then great i gain all that attack the fuck is that target one card for those short balance and they're special okay so that's what you're planning on doing just bringing her right back so i'll go ahead and kill her you take no damage No damage. You take no damage. Sanctuary. Unless you're not a fairy. No, you're a fairy. No. Gain 800. I'm not going to sit here and baby you. There you go. This is gone. Um, so we just got to see, but pretty much uh, so far, 
I just put everything that didn't get hit because I knew it wouldn't get hit, and uh, you know, depending on how well the deck the deck's top, uh, we can go ahead and see some movement. Oop, did not mean to do that. That was my bad. So unprofessional. <laughs> so uh, maybe we'll see. You know, maybe Madoches won't do anything, and maybe they won't get touched. All right. Okay. Oh, there goes my scrap dragon. Now since he's 500 less attack because of Splendid Venus. Oh, yeah, 500. Another Summoner Monk. Okay. Guess I could pitch the Dark Hole. Is that permanent? Or is that why it's only on the field? I don't know. I don't know. I guess I can summon summon a monk pitch, summon and summon something, make a one oh one. Why not? And take his damn monster. What does it say? The activation of cannot be negated, okay. Correct. Go ahead and pitch Dark Hole to the graveyard, because it really doesn't seem like I'll need it right now. We'll go ahead and summon Old Armageddon Knight. He will get his effect. I will go ahead and put Yubel in the graveyard, since we haven't put Yubel in the graveyard, of course. Go ahead and make a 101. 101. Actually, I can make an Exiton. You have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and I have 1, 2, 3, 4. Yeah, I can make an Exiton. I'm down on resources, therefore I will wipe you. We'll make a 101 when you can make an Exiton, right? <laughs> and we'll get rid of this problem card and this problem card. Can't do any damage this turn, but hey. Got rid of them problem cards. Because he was really sucking on this card's nips. So, good thing that's gone. Um, so, you know, I got Soul Charge on there, Fire and Ice Hand. Uh, you know, just cards that I can simply just see being moved just because, I don't know, after the profit margin, they're done with it. So, uh, maybe like Curry Bandit for Dragon Rulers and... Hopefully Blackhorn. <laughs> uh, that, that's probably the most upsetting thing, you know. You know, Soul Charge should, in my opinion, should be banned or limited to one. Why not? You have more resources than me, therefore I can wipe your field. Why can I not use my Beals effect? I mean, not my Beals effect, my Exiton effect. You have one, two, three, four, five. I have one, two, three, four. No, I don't. No, I don't. I have four. You have five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. N can you not count? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Nigga. Like, you can't count? And then you quit. Like, count, nigga. Count. Oh, I quit. I quit. I can't count to five. <laughs> can't count to five. The struggle. I can't even count the damn five. All right. Uh, do I have enough time? Yeah, we can get one more in. We can get one more in. You know, that, you know, with, uh, with Soul Charge, take it or leave it. At least not every deck is playing it. If I feel sacked when it gets hit by it, but at least not every deck is playing it. But competitive circuit-wise, every deck and their mother, you're either main decking or side decking some black horns. And, you know, I just think the card's bullshit because it pretty much just punishes you for playing the particular deck that you're playing, which is just bullshit. It pretty much just say, hey, if you don't fucking play, uh, if you don't fucking play Bujins or Artifacts, you're just going to get the D because uh, anytime you fucking try to inherit summon, I'm just going to fuck you in the ass, so... I don't know. I, I just, I just really, 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 really hate, really, really, really hate. Uh, uh actually, no, it. That's dumb. I'm not planning on ex overextending like that. I'm just gonna normal summon. Effect. I'll pay cost. You know, I just think that's kind of crap. That inherent summons. No, fuck you. 
doesn't, you know, Solid Morning at least hits everybody and everything, you know, you know, whether you're using an Inherent Summon or you're using a Fusion Summon or you're using Soul Chart or something, bam, Solid Morning, pay my 2,000, it's negated, everybody gets it, everybody gets it, everybody, everybody summons, everybody gets it, you know, I mean, people who don't get maybe or I don't know, I don't know, fucking Burn, Zodiac of Ducks, I don't know, but, fucking Blackhorn, no cost. You use inherent summons, give you the middle finger. It's just like, okay, well, that's great. I'm sorry, I just. I don't like that card. I just think it's unfair. It makes me sad every time it's used on me. Bitch, I can do math. I don't know why everybody assumes I'm a fucking idiot on here. Y'all niggas are the idiots. So, hopefully, you know, you know, with the, with the whole Mirror Force and D-Prison thing, I guess. I mean, Mirror Force, I can see going up to 3. D-Prison? I didn't see it going up to 3, not even remotely. D-Prison's still a really powerful card, pretty much staple, because fucking hands, which also didn't get hit, so. We can totally expect that deck to, uh, you know, continue being uh, annoying, you know. So, if people want to use uh, Hat and... In you know nationals and worlds, hey. So at least we know what to keep our eye out for. Was that two? Yeah, that's two. Ugh, everybody and their mother is using light swords right now, which is fine. The only problem with me doing light swords is that this deck is can't really handle light swords that well. Well, next turn I'm bring, I'm I'm bringing out Beals. Like JD, come on, come on, nigga, Beals. Okay. Uh, I don't need tomato. Oh, gardener. Okay. Summon BLS. Night beam the shit out of that card. Can night beam anything else right now, so why the fuck not? No chaining. No MST, no, no fucking, uh, what's it called? Uh, beckoning. Nope. No chain. You can't. Just put it to the graveyard. Tch. Scrub goes in there. Alright. Alright. Activate Silent Doom. Silent Doom. Revive Doom Shaman. I will use my, oh, normal summon for effect. Effect, I will go ahead and bring back Tinker. Tinker summon into Beals. Who of course won't get killed by Terror, and then also JD just goes. I don't know how to handle Beals. <laughs> Tinker effect. Let's go ahead and see the top card. Do I want to miss Tomato? No. He said I don't. I'm, I'm fine. I'm set up. These cards are just useful for setup. So right now all he has is two. Yeah, two light thorns. Yeah, okay, yeah. Okay, effect is used. Effect is used. Yeah, Bills can't be destroyed by card effects, so he stays. Never mind. Yeah, I'm so I thought. Activate call. I'm back to him, Shaman. Use my normal summon for effect. Effect. I'm gonna attack before I fucking <sighs> take the tinker. Take the shaman. Block the beals, or you lose. Oh, curry, sure. Okay. Okay. Go ahead and sink. Oh. Sink eight. Oh, 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 oh. I didn't click my face too. I thought I did, but I didn't. I'll just go for another bills. Think you're fat? You're taking way too much damage to the chin, sir. Can you not use the effects the same turn, or yes, you can? You can only activate one of these effects once per turn. Okay. 
Go ahead. Oh, he's running the Cephalon way. I guess. Dark hole. You hit tear. Okay. Good shit. What you gonna do? Copy JD? Sure. Why did you discard Wolf? Oh, you're copying Lumina. Is that it? I'm so confused. I'm so confused. I guess. I guess. I'm so confused. Like, <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? Like, you know, you gotta banish the Lumina to copy her if that's what you're doing. You know, I was like, who the fuck are you copying? <laughs> I thought he was gonna copy JD, which really would have done nothing. <laughs> you know, it's copy JD. Use my effect. I'd probably just go chain call the Huns and bring back Ubel just so I can summon out Terra again just to slap him in the face and be like, look what you did. Nothing. <laughs> Anyway, uh, I'm going to go ahead and call an episode. So, uh, yeah, if you're not used to my new mic, I apologize. I don't know what to do. It just sounds a lot different. I'm not sure if it sounds better. not sure if it sounds worse, but it just sounds different. So, uh, if I can't get it to work, then I don't know. I paid I paid a lot of money for this mic, and to not have it work would really suck ass. You know, I paid like 60 bucks for this mic, and my usual one I pay is like 30 So, I thought it'd be better quality. Uh, it's wireless. It plugs into the USB instead of the, uh, you know, the, you know, the pink and the green in the back. So, you know, hopefully it's better, but if it's not, I apologize. But uh, I hope you guys enjoyed despite that. So, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow with you Bounds Actors. Thanks for watching.